back from the dead <laughs> my channel in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how i got this look and actually today's video is a collab video with um adenike akipalu that's her youtube name so you guys should check out we decided to do this um we decided to use the urban decay electric palette to to create like a spring makeup look i decided to use green as the main color for the collab um this is my own look this is what i came up with um, I'm going to leave a, a link to her own video so you guys can go check her out You guys can go and see what she did and also I didn't use lashes with this look because I just can't I just can't be bothered <laughs> I don't know it's so stressful and I don't feel like using lashes, but it would be so nice if you guys can use lashes for the look um, If you guys want to know how to use lashes then I'm, you can go and check Adenika's um, Makeup page because she like she did a video on how to use lashes and how to apply lashes so you can go check out uh, her own video uh what else this is my own look i hope you guys like it um i'm going to just leave you guys to enjoy this video i wanted to show you guys how i've been prepping my skin before applying my makeup my foundation so um i know i told you guys that I know in my um, foundation routine video I used this primer, but the way I actually used it, used it in that video was totally wrong. So now that I actually know how to use it, <laughs> and it actually works now, I'm going to show you guys how I do it now so you guys can... And if you guys want to see like a new foundation routine video, let me know so I can film that because my makeup has been looking on flick lately. So. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I normally do, what I've been doing now. The first thing I like to do is apply a primer, a face primer, and this one is from Scandinavia. You can actually use any um, primer spray you want to use. I like to use this one. Actually, I've been using two. So, I've been mixing the Scandinavia primer spray with the Smashbox primer water. And the only reason why I'm actually mixing this is because I have this one. I'm like, okay, why can't I just use both? So you don't have to use it. And basically this just leaves your face feeling hydrated and nice. I'm just going to let it dry before applying my moisturizer. Also, I know I made a video where I was using the Milk of Magnesia as my primer and it's actually not good for your skin. So if you know you like yourself, don't use Milk of Magnesia. And even if you want to use Milk of Magnesia, Make make sure that you've prepped your face, you've done the moisturizing, you've already moisturized your face. Don't just go directly with the makeup magnesia on your face. Make sure your skin is prepped, like you moisturize, you put like a, another primer on top before using the makeup magnesia just to serve as a barrier between the primer, the makeup magnesia and your skin so it doesn't penetrate into your skin. There are actually different types of moisturizer for different skin types and this one that I used is the, called the Embryolis Emotion Emo emulsion hydra matte and it's actually really good for um let me see if you can focus can you focus it's actually really good for um oily skin so i'm just going to take a little bit of this primer on my fingers and then i'm just going to just Okay, now with this primer, I'm focusing on areas of my face that are not as oily because I kind of have a, a I kind of have a combination skin. So basically, I just focus on areas that is not so oily, and then when I get to the parts that gets like really oily fast, I'm just going to like dab. You also want to make sure that your under eyes are really hydrated. So this is not a foundation routine video. I just wanted to quickly show you guys what I've been doing with my skin prep for applying my foundation. You can also apply to your neck because I'm going to be um, applying makeup to my neck. So you also want to make sure that you apply to your neck. I'm going to go in with the primer. The Becca Ever Matte Poreless Primer. And I'm going to be using this. Kind of 
all over my face but not really all over my face so you want to dab this into your skin see I'm pressing it into my skin I'm kind of applying this all over my face but the thing is you don't need it all over your face because this primer is pretty expensive yeah so like just apply it on areas that you need it apply it on areas that you need that really really needs the primer basically what you want to do right now is just let it set let it just do it let's just do its job so now i'm going to actually go into my eyes i'm going to start my eyes i just wanted to show you guys that i don't know if i'm going to show you if i'm going to record the foundation part of the video because i don't want this video to be too long but i wanted you guys to see the skin prep dogs good and um, for my eyeshadow i've been using a, a lighter concealer and i'm using this one from LA Girl in cool Tan. Now that I've applied the primer, the concealer as the primer, I'm going to set it. And I'm going to be using this one. This is just a random translucent powder that I've had God knows since, since when I've had it. But yeah, for my transition shade, I'm using this one. I'm mixing this too. But I'll use this on the outer part and then this to warm it up. Hell yeah. So I'm going to be using this. For the lead. So I decided to show you guys my highlight because this highlight is just the best. I'm telling you. And the palette I'm using is the Kali Bible. Bible or Bible? I don't know. Palette. And it's a nice shadow palette with like highlight at the bottom. And I'm using these two shades right here. They are just. <laughs> I'm going to be using the chestnut and clueless. Chestnut the pencil and clueless. Okay, now I'm back to finish up the look. Is it in focus? I can't see. I cannot see. But it's obvious, it's definitely in focus because this is a new lens and my lens can focus by itself now. For the lower lash line, I'm going to use this. This two shades. Back, 
back from the dead. I'm going to spray my face with Scandinavia setting spray, finishing spray. So I'm using the real my benefit the real mascara to my lashes. On my lashes. For the tear ducts, I'm going to be using this one that I used in my last video. Ladies and gentlemen, you're all invited to go fucking mental on this motherfucking drop. The countdown has just begun.